hello everyone welcome back in this video we are going to see azure batch service so basically uh, this service you know can be used to run you know large scale high performance computing batch jobs for example to you know run the image and video processing we can use the azure batch service and uh, this will be run in the parallel mode so uh, we need to have the azure batch account and we also need the azure storage account where we will be storing the application basically we need the application to you know post this uh, process or this uh, you know data and uh, also we will be storing the image and videos in this storage account and uh, so that information you know will be uh, pulled from this storage account to this pool of virtual machines and uh, the application can run on these uh, virtual machines to process the files that are you know stored in the azure storage account so uh, the azure batch service the nodes are you know used in the uh, batch account will you know run the applications and uh, that would process the workloads and the nodes are you know running in the pool of virtual machines that we will be defining in the azure batch account and we can use the script or the executables on those nodes and we can you know uh, include uh, the file extensions like a dot exe dot cmd or dot bat and powershell script for windows as well and for the linux we can use the binaries shell and python script as well so there will be two types of nodes in the azure batch service which is a uh, dedicated nodes and low priority nodes the dedicated nodes that will you know reserved nodes and uh, we can guarantee that the jobs will run on those nodes always but in case of low priority nodes these are less expensive but it will you know depend on the surplus capacity which is available in the azure so based on the usage and the requirement and the critical of the you know the workload we can choose which node we need to go on okay so that's it in this video and i'll see you in the next thank you